All right, guys, welcome back. We are now on part 23 of Secret of Mana. So we have just cleared out the first two thirds of the Mana Fortress. Uh, we then swiftly ran away and in order to restock all our supplies, and now we are making the final assaults. There's only two bosses left in the game. One boss in the Mana Fortress, and then the infamous Mana Beast itself. making our way up. no way to open shortcuts in the Mana Fortress. powerful as long as they don't corner you and beat the crap out of you. Stay activated. And we need to get these guys dead so that we can advance. No, we won't. We have to go. It makes sense. Life a little easier. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on, you fools. Let's go. Really? Really? Oh, friggin' status ailments. Shapeshifters are weird in that they sometimes kill themselves when they get transformed. Come on. Go, oh, get over here. Wrong way. And just every once in a while, the game decides to get completely stuck in the level geometry.
Well, since he Lucid Barrier himself to uh, any physical attacks, we'll just blast him with that.
Yeah, no. Come on. Come on. Let's go. We're not dealing with this. We're finally getting to the end game. Holy crap, that's a threat. Hey, look, this is where we fought the final Mechwar Rider. Okay, as you might imagine, we are about to fight the one of the final bosses. Good idea to kill off. And Thanatos is dead, yay! Or not. Dialogue is dead. And now Thanatos becomes the Dark Lich. Um, stay far, far away. That, that is the best I can, that is the best, uh, I can offer. When he does his little uh, fists in the ground, yeah, you, you don't even... Don't go near because those hands will pen and will spread you in seconds. I'm gonna add him until you run out of MP for the girl, and then just spam spells with the spray. He has a lot of health, but he soaks damage like crazy. As long as you stay to the extreme left or the extreme right, all Thanatos can really do to harm you is uh, Petrify Beam and occasionally cast some high level magic tank. But ideally, you want to come in here with a higher level Lumina so that you can do more damage for cats. But as you can see, a level 3 going into level 4 Lumina is still dealing a good chunk. Good shot of Lumino taken out. 
Good. We still have two fairy walnuts for the final boss. Suck damage and die damage. So before you head off to the final uh, to the final boss, get give the boy the mana sword because he's going to need it. And now Thanatos is dead, but so is Dylan. Fight the Mana Beast to save the world. I really hope you spend some time uh, leveling up Dryad because you need Dryad's mana magic in order to even damage this thing. Before we do anything else, the uh, very first thing we want to do is we want to take Lumina and equip the Lucid and cast the Barrier, which gives us an immunity to. Uh, physical attacks, which the majority of the Mana Beast's attacks are. Now, in order to provide the sword, both the Sprite and the Girl must cast Mana Magic on the hero at the same time. Doing so, we have revived the mana sword. Now, the majority of the fight, the mana beast is just going to be flying around doing unavoidable attacks. Every so often, it will fly up and, you know, actually come to say hi. When you charge up, you don't really need to charge up that high, just level 1 or 2 is sufficient, but then you just go and you whack it with a mana sword. I mean, you don't even really need to charge it at all, actually. But, make sure to keep refresh refreshing mana magic every so often, because... also do is give the boy Luna Boost to up his critical rate and inflict a hell of a lot more damage. The Mana Beast has 9,999, or 9,990, so it's going to be a bit of a fight. Make 
sure you have plenty of fairy wallets for the girl because she's going to be casting a lot more magic than the, uh, than the sprite is. the world. Enjoy the ending, guys.
stabbing a sword in its face, but whatever. Okay, you put the sword back, now how are you going to get back to the town? You saw the other mana weapons? And the thing is gone. I kind of missed the little bastard. Alright guys, and that was Secret of Mana. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Um, I am actually going to go ahead and call it here a night, or call it a night here. It's a little early than, than usual, but uh, what I plan on doing is I'm going to be basically grinding up the remaining levels uh, for the magic just to show off the, uh, the super spells in a bonus video. So um, join me next week. Uh, well, I'll be showing off that bonus video, and then we'll be starting our next project, which will be the sequel to Secret of Mana, uh, known as Second Densetsu 3. It only came out in Japan, but uh, with a more, probably a, a more interesting storyline, because it had multiple branches that you could do, depending on who you pick for your characters. But we'll get to that when we actually start that game, so see you, uh, have a great night, everybody. See you next week.